Members of the Chinese Communist Party applauded the accomplishments of Xi Jinping and reaffirmed Xi's role as China's president. Air Force retired Brigadier General Robert Spalding suggests Xi is likely to increase Christian and Uyghur persecution, promote anti-U.S. alliances, and expand China's military reach around the world. Jason Ho with Teclium doesn't think China would risk a hot war with the United States. And despite tough talk from President Biden and other leaders, Ho says China has strong business ties in the states, along with major influence on social media. This is very well planned. They know how to use Taiwan. They know how to use duality to achieve their goals. One big step to counter China, according to Spalding, came when President Biden signed the Chips and Science Act. That law provides billions in subsidies and tax credits to help expand the U.S. semiconductor industry. And when you look at it from the Chinese side, what they're saying is they've essentially decapitated China's ability to uh, evolve their chip industry.